It's ridiculous. Take and take and take. We want to get to Jeb? Yeah, we'll get to Jeb. Just take it easy. Slow down. I'm complaining about how much work we have. Okay, fair. That's always... That's a way of leading into Jeb. Oh. You see what I'm doing? Is, I do. You know what? Form well follows function. Well done. All right? And so I'm, 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 getting into Jeb. I'm getting into my Jeb sense of mind. Where's your clock? Do you people understand? Do you people understand? How thankful you should be. And frankly, I'm not the only one who hasn't noticed that this country has shown a distinct lack of appreciation that Jeb Bush has decided to do you all a favor and run for president. I don't know why that isn't even remotely funny. The lack of appreciation, it's just about take 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 he is doing you a huge solid folks and you don't appreciate it and jeb bush has finally come out and said it here he is at a presidential town hall in south carolina i mean he's traveling to south carolina for <laughs> god's sakes it was hosted by senator tim scott L listen to what jeb bush is saying and tell me he's wrong if this election is about how we're going to fight to get nothing done, then I don't want anything. I don't want any part of it. I don't want to be elected president to sit around and see gridlock just become so dominant that people literally are in decline in their lives. That is not my motivation. I got a lot of really cool things that I could do other than sit around being miserable, listening to people demonize me and me feeling compelled to demonize them. That is a joke. Elect Trump if you want that. If you want somebody. Do you want somebody who has a heart for people, who can fight for people, and can fix these things, then there are a couple other people, and I believe I'm the best one. And that's what we should be focused on. You see, uh, now, so basically, uh, Jeb basically said this when he started his campaign, too. Like, I'm not going to, give me a break. I got a lot of cool things to do. Do you have any idea how great my life could be right now? But yeah, instead... I go and be, and you know, basically it sounds to me, he's, you know what he's doing, right? Setting up for the exit. He's setting up for the exit, and he's basically, he's already practicing his Thanksgiving dinner speech to his family, where he says to Jeb, where he says to Dad, Dad, and, and incidentally, there was a piece out there about how just uh, uh, unbelievably taxing this is. For the elder Bushes. I mean, the idea that the American public would treat Jeb this way is just stunning. And this, of course, is um, Jeb Bush has been reported to have cut, slashed his campaign staff because he's running out of money, folks, because people don't want to give money to him. And you know what? He's he's practicing his Thanksgiving Day speech. He's going to be sitting around the table. He's going to be talking to George. George is going to go say something like this, like, you know, hey. Looks like somebody couldn't hack it, huh? Isn't that right, gay lord? <laughs> and then Jeb is going to say, I didn't want to do it anyways. Because I didn't want to sit around there and... I, mean, I got cooler things to do. You heard me say that two months ago. That's what I'm doing now. Su Supergirl's coming on TV. <laughs> and I got uh, a TiVo. And my, my other friends got a bank... Uh, uh, for derivatives, and that will make more money, and and we can watch the shows, and I mean, plenty of good things. You don't want that, then don't have me. Hey, tell me, fat bags, you wouldn't know what to do with Supergirl if she was sitting right in front of you. Mom, 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 am I going to have to sit through this for the entirety of the of the meal? I mean, mom, it's don't forget, I was president twice. Okay, so. Uh, it's gonna lord that over me. I, I'm. I could watch. I. I could work out with dumbbells and then watch Supergirl. I mean, there's a lot of other things uh, to do hey, in buddy, life. Let's let's see if I can make shit his pants cry. Hey, shit your pants! You shit your pants! <laughs> Got you. Got you. Uh, so, uh, I don't know. Jeb Bush, uh, just uh, reiterating, he's got a lot of cool things to do, folks. So don't mess around with him. You know whose presidency he was sort of d uh, describing, right? obstruction, getting maligned, being told maybe you're not even American. He's talking about Barack Obama.
I just made Michael cry. 